The simulation theory is that our reality isn't a reality at all, but actually we're in some sort of extremely advanced simulation. Your consciousness is software. The fundamental premise is that there's a mysterious, super advanced civilization that runs computer programs to simulate all sorts of phenomena, including reality itself. A world that's totally fake. An imaginary world where the people inside think that they're living a normal life when actually they're asleep in some pod someplace. The idea there has actually been around for quite a long time. There's science fiction dating back many decades. And people have basically said that if simulating reality is possible, why would they just stop at simulating one reality? So if it is possible, then there's going to be lots of simulated realities, and those realities themselves will end up simulating other realities. So the argument goes that we're almost certainly living in a simulated reality. Computers started off very weak, relatively speaking, very large, and now they're incredibly powerful and small, and our software has evolved to the point where we have virtual reality simulations. So what if there is some advanced civilization that is far beyond where humans are, then could they create a simulation that is something like what we consider reality? What if you had an alien civilization that had been working on this for millions, if not billions of years, and they build computers that encompass an entire solar system? Billions of billions of billions of billions of times more powerful than anything we can possibly imagine, then the realities that could be simulated on that computer are just going to be unimaginably more real than we can possibly envisage with our current technology. Then you could imagine that virtual reality could get more and more advanced to the point where you can't tell it apart from the real world. But the main argument against us living in a matrix is the very existence itself. That would have to be a very complex code because we live in a system that's made up of elementary particles. Just think of every proton and electron in the universe. There are so many atoms in the universe, so many possible simulations, so many possible futures, that it would require more atoms than the entire universe to recreate scenes of the matrix. But it's impossible to disprove a negative. Let's say that you want to disprove the matrix theory or disprove angels and unicorns. Well, you can't, because someplace on the Earth, there could be angels and unicorns hiding. So if reality is some kind of a simulation, then strange things are going to happen because no code is perfect. But unfortunately, when I look into these things, they generally have a pretty boring explanation. Uh, which is a shame, really, because I would, I would like there to be a bit more magic in the world.